everyone, so today I've got a little Zara haul for you all. It's not a huge, huge haul, there's just some really nice blouses and a few little bits and bobs. So yeah, I thought it would be interesting to show you guys what I bought. If you're not subscribed already, please go down and click the subscribe button and also turn on the notifications so you'll be notified when I upload a video. So yeah, let's get straight into this haul. I wasn't planning on putting this top in the haul, but I just realised that this is from Zara and I'm not sure if I've put it in a haul before, but I'll link it down below anyway if you're interested. So the first item is this suede, sort of western themed skirt, and if you guys know me, I love the western theme, and just like western clothing, and I was obsessed with Pocahontas as a child, and my mum was like, that's like a Pocahontas skirt, and I was like, oh, it is. <laughs> This was on a slightly more pricey side for Zara, but I just love their skirts. I'm really fussy with skirts, and Zara is literally the only place I like to buy skirts from because they're always the right length and the right fit, although I had to get them in an extra small, so I don't know what people smaller than me have to do about skirts from Zara. This is what the skirt looks like on. I'm obsessed with this skirt. As I said, it was like one of those things that you just see and you're just instantly like, I need it. <laughs> So I'm really glad I picked it up. I love the tasseling. It's got like two layers of tasseling and then some really cool studs along here. Then this is what the back looks like. Probably wouldn't wear it with this stripy top, but you know, um, yeah, I really like it. I feel like linen is coming back into fashion for this summer. Um, so I picked up this linen shirt and it looks like this. And I really love the neckline. It's got like a little bit of a collar so it kind of looks a bit smart, but then it's got this V-neck, um, which I think I'll have to put a safety pin in because it's quite um, gapy. I had to get it in size large because I didn't have any other sizes, and it's just one of those things that I saw and I just had to have. <laughs> and I mean, I do wear my clothes quite oversized anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But I've left the label in it, so if I find one smaller, then I can always exchange it. I love this shirt but I think it is just a bit too big so I think I'm going to have to take it back and get a medium or a small. But yeah, I love the fact that it's actually linen because it doesn't feel like linen that much. But I think maybe after a wash it might feel more like linen. Yeah, you can tuck it into shorts in the summer and just have it really casual. So yeah, I love this shirt. Next up I found this really cute white denim pinafore dungaree thing and it just looked so comfy and I tried it on and it just it didn't cling it was just nice and a-line and just flowed over the hips so this is just going to be such a comfy throw on piece for the summer and I also love the colour it's sort of like an off whitey blue it's coming up white on the camera but it's just really lovely and it's got some pockets in the back and it's just a really cute little thing. I love this denim dungaree dress. It's so cute. Oh, you definitely don't want to wear it with tights. I tried wearing it with tights the other day and it just looked wrong. Um, so it's definitely a bare leg sort of item. Um, it looks cute with this little striped top actually. Um, and then the back looks like that. Um, got some little patch pockets at the back. Oh, <laughs> my finger pokes through it. <laughs> And then pockets at the front as well, so it's just really like slouchy and comfy and easy to wear. So I love items like this so much. And I also like the roundness of the neckline. Um, most dungaree dress is sort of like square, so this just gives a bit more shaping and looks a bit more feminine I think. So, love it! This haul has a very common theme of white blouses by the way, so just letting you know. This next one is just so cute. I love the back with the crisscross. I really like this sort of style that's coming into fashion at the moment. And then it's got a little um, button down the back. I bought this in a medium, but I think I definitely need it in a small, so I might just have to go into Zara and change some things um, if I can find them in small sizes. The problem with Zara and white blouses is that everything has foundation marks on it already, so I couldn't buy any of the smalls because they just had so much foundation on them that I was just like... No. But anyway, this was too cute to miss, so I picked this up. So I'm pretty sure I need to go and get a small in this one because this is the medium and it's fine at the front, but at the back it's quite gapy. 
and I just feel like a small would be much more suitable for this sort of style but I really like it, it's really cute so the back is my favourite part about it you wouldn't be able to wear a bra with it because it just shows um, but you kind of can't wear a bra with the holes being where they are as well so I think you just have to wear like a nipple cover or something um, but yeah, I think I need to get a size small because this is just a bit strange then another white blouse but this has a little bit of cream in it <laughs> the cream is definitely not coming up on camera but I'll show you it in more detail when I try it on um, but it's just got this really lovely sort of square front lapel bit um, and then it's just got cream embroidery of flowers all over it and it's just so pretty so yeah Zara definitely killing it with the blouses at the moment so this is what the blouse looks like, super, super cute. I'll come up close so you can see the embroidery that I was talking about. It's just nice, I love the mix of white and cream together. The back of it just has two sort of lace panels down the back and then there's a tie up at the back. The length is quite short, um, maybe if it was a bit longer it might have looked a bit better. So yeah, I'm really happy I picked this up actually because it could be smart or dressed down. So yeah, really happy with that. Then finally, I can't go into Zara without picking out one of their basics. This is um, one of their basic striped t-shirts. They're just so comfy and soft and this was £5 so I was like, that's crazy. I actually picked this up in a size large because I've had this before and it shrunk quite a bit in the wash so I thought start big, end up small. So here's the striped t-shirt on, it's just one of my favourite basics, I just love the shape, it's quite nice and boxy and just, yeah, just got really nice stripes so I like it. And for £5 you really can't go wrong. So that is it, that is everything from my Zara haul, I hope you guys enjoyed it, if you did give it a thumbs up, let me know which item was your favourite down below and yeah make sure to subscribe if you haven't and also please remember to turn on the notifications thing because then you'll know if I upload a video. And yeah that is it from me, I hope you're all having a wonderful day and I will see you in my next video, bye!